It's furniture delivery day, but I'm about to go um, on my walk first, get that out the way, and then come back in and get ready, and then we'll wait <laughs> for the delivery because I don't think it's coming until between 12 and 2, so we got a little bit of time to wait. Oh, I also need to show y'all the new duvet cover because that came last night and I put it on and I actually really like it. So, yeah. Right now I'm about halfway through my walk. Well, a little more than halfway, maybe two thirds. And I'm at 3,600 steps. So I haven't, shouldn't have a problem getting my full 7,000 this week. I just got a, a phone call from RH saying that the driver had two cancellations and wondering if I would be willing to accept delivery at 1030 and yes I am <laughs> so sorry I had to try to find some light um but yeah now I'm just about to go back in the house fold the clothes and stuff so I can get ready to receive delivery because my room has a lot of clean clothes that need to be folded and put away so whew, that is what we're about to do all right, so here's the before. I finally put, <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, y'all. I didn't have a chance to show y'all me like straightening up the room because they're gonna be here in like five minutes. But um, this is the before. I really, really like the color of this new duvet. I think it is a oh, duvet cover. I think it's so cute. Definitely giving spring. Um, but yeah, this is the before. Looks really good. Can't wait to see how it's gonna look once we get the um, nightstands and dresser. This is the before of this wall without any furniture at all on it. Obviously, the well, not obviously, but the dresser is going here. So I'll show y'all, try to get some footage of the delivery itself. And then I'll also show y'all the actual finished product, of course. OMG, it looks so good. I do want it scooted over just a little bit, but it looks so good. It's so cute. So I feel like it needs to come over a little bit because first of all, it's way too much extra empty space here and it's just off center. And second, it's kind of like you almost run into it <laughs> coming into the door. Here's the view. You can actually see it from the hallway because it's so close to the door. Yeah, it needs to needs to go over a little bit. Yeah, it looks it looks so good. I'm shook. I'm so happy that we didn't pick just go with anything just to get something earlier on because this it eats. It's so cute. I love it so much. Okay, let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. It looks. We're backlit, y'all. So you can't really like see this see it the same way I see it, cause 
is a window behind it, but Ugh, let me back y'all up. These dressers are, I mean, these nightstands are so freaking huge and so nice. The quality, the quality and the smell, it smells so new. Yeah. So here's the dresser. I had to go back and forth a couple times with them to try to get the right position, but we got it. And I feel like it's perfectly centered. Here's the other nightstand, and here is the dresser. Hold on, Cody. Give me one second. Come here. Yeah, the drawers. It is so. It's so big. Like, I feel like this is not really doing it justice because this wall is like 90 some inches. This thing is huge and tall. Like, I could prop y'all on the dresser. <laughs> and it comes to above my chest. Like, it comes to my chest. Okay, now that all the excitement is over, I'm making some corned beef hash for myself for breakfast. And... I had to write with markers. So Cody wrote me a poem, so we're about to hear the stylings of Miss Cubby. I'm, I had I wrote in marker, so it looks really weird. Dad. Okay, go ahead. So the mom. My mom is a rose in the garden of our home, with filling every flower. moment with a fragrant with a fragrant beauty. Filling every moment with a fragrant beauty. Yeah. Okay. It was hard to say. I feel like every moment with a fragrant beauty. Mm hmm Giving. Yes. Okay. Let's hear the rest. Hmm? That's it. Oh. It's short and sweet. Oh. Okay. You should be beautiful. Did you expect it to be like five paragraphs long? I don't know. I expected. I don't know. I like. I just like short You have cheese out of there. Mm -hmm. It was beautiful. Thank you. Okay. All right, y'all. Once I'm done eating, I'm going to go to Fredericksburg because I need to go to Costco and get the lobster rolls. And then, yeah, I got to come back home and take them to swim later. So I think I'll take y'all around the same time at like 4.45. And then that Is way y'all can get the whole... Six? Yeah, that way y'all can get the whole, you know, like 45 minutes to swim before class and then... You said, we'll you mean 5.45? Because you said... Cody, huh? I said, I'm going to take y'all at 4.45 so you can get 45 minutes to swim, or an hour to swim before class. Okay. You want some eggs? Okay, y'all. Corey is doing her work. I just we finished her math. She did some addition, and now she's writing her letters. We already reviewed all of her letters and letter sounds, so she's good for the duel. I almost hit that. Um, she is good. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, she's good to go. As soon as she finishes uh, tracing all of her letters, uppercase and lowercase, then she'll be done with work for the day. And she can move on to going to ride her bike or whatever she wants to do, playing outside, all that. Um, I am heading to Fredericksburg. One, I want to try to do the new Duncan releases. They came out yesterday. Today is May 2nd. They came out on the 1st. And um, they have like a donut swirl now because y'all know they get a new swirl every season so like last season it was the churro swirl and they had a churro iced coffee and now it's a donut flavored swirl and um they have a donut iced coffee like an iced vanilla donut iced coffee or something so yeah i need, also need to go pick up the counter stools i got my pickup ticket let me show y'all my whole address i got my um pickup ticket for the art house in fredericksburg so i'm gonna go ahead and pick my counter stools up 
while I'm out there too. And then I also need to go to Costco because I need to try those new uh, lobster rolls, the lobster rolls at Costco. Definitely wanna try that. So that's my three stops <laughs> in Fredericksburg. Costco, Our House, and Dunkin'. Oh, I need to also go to Amazon or UPS and return because I have some Amazon returns and I need to go to the car wash because we went to the beach yesterday and it's sand all up in that trunk that I need to get vacuumed out plus the car. All the pollen and stuff is taking a toll. We need to get the car cleaned. Okay, y'all. It looks so good. It smells so good. When I when they opened that window at Duncan, the smell that came out of there <laughs> smelled so darn good. Okay, let me turn the air on because it's hot. It's 90 degrees. Lord, when did it get that hot? Okay, 90 degrees is crazy. And it's going back down to 60 my camera about to run out of um, memory card okay let me get my straw here it is I got a cold brew instead of a iced coffee with um, three donut swirls two caramel swirls and cream for cream oh I should have got light ice but I forgot so that's what it looks like I don't know what it tastes like and this cold brew is strong today, so it's taken away. Like, I, all I can really taste is coffee and sweet. I'm not really getting the flavor of the donut swirl. I'm about to try it again another day so I can give y'all a proper assessment of the flavor because it's kind of, it just tastes like coffee. If you don't have 30, 40, 50 minutes for a vacuum session, just go ahead and skip the beach, girl, because, oh my gosh, my whole lunch break, gone, because I was vacuuming this darn car out. It was sand in every crevice. Crevice. Crevice is the right word. Anyway, my camera is about to run out of storage. Um, next stop is our house. So let's go. I'm about to use my phone. Okay, y'all, we're here. Let's run in and grab the counter stools. See what else they got. Cause why not? They also have 40% off lighting, but I don't really see anything that I would want to buy. <laughs> Somebody got the five um, Jagger dining chairs I was telling y'all about. That was a good deal, a really, really good deal. And they were in perfect condition. We got our counter stools. I'm so excited, y'all. Our H and our house in the same day. Love that for me, okay? Y'all already know we have counter stools already that are in really good shape. So I am probably, I think, did I tell you this already? I'm probably just going, going I'm probably just going to use them um, at first I was like, if the kids mess up the counter stools we have now, then I can go ahead and swap them out for those. But when I think about it, realistically, we have insurance on the counter stools we have now. So if they mess it up beyond the point of, you know, repair, we would get, you know, file an insurance claim, get the money back and either buy the same counter stool or buy something different. So that's probably not the most, that's probably not how it's going to play out. <laughs> 
Um, what will probably be more likely is that I will get tired of the ones that are there right now and want to swap them out for something for the our house ones just to get a different look. Um, I think that's probably the more realistic option. And then the other option is that I could put one of the sets of counter stools into the basement whenever we get it finished because as y'all know, my plan for the basement is to turn it into an apartment, like a two bedroom apartment. So it's a transitional space for the kids. As they transition out of you know their teenage years and into adulthood, they'll have somewhere that's their own, that's not, you know, not necessarily out of the house, but also not in the house because it has a private entrance and it, it could really be could really be an apartment so um they wouldn't have to see us so I, it'll have a full kitchen and you know i'll be able to put a counter or an island down there that has like an extended um countertop where i can put more counter stools so that's another option of what we could do with it um, I have no idea what the basement is going to, what the design of the basement will be once we actually get to that project because who the heck knows how long it's going to take for us to be able to do that. Um, but that is my plan for the basement. That's what I would love to see for the basement. That way all three, all four kids <laughs> will have somewhere to live when they're no longer, you know, wanting to live at home but also not quite ready to move out fully. It'll be perfect. So that is my plan. Anyway, I'm at... Home goods right now. I think I'm gonna run in real quick and see if they have anything as far as the lamps because that's what we need. And then, yeah, I need to go home. Oh, I need to go in Costco and then I need to go home because I gotta get the kids ready for swim. I don't know why this is so cute to me, but it just is. Like, I just really. I think this is so cute. This is the color that I would get because, as y'all know, I'm a silver girl, not a gold girl at all. But they only have one of it anyway, so it wouldn't be an option because obviously we have two night stand, night stands that need a, a lamp. This is cute for like a desk. This would be adorable. Even in this brass color, I really like it. That's a good price too. That's nice. Part of me likes these. Part of me doesn't. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I do kind of like this with the light inside. Is it heavy? Actually, yeah, it is kind of heavy. <sighs> I don't know how I feel about it. I like it, but I don't love it. You know? I think it's just okay. <gasps> oh, we have another one, but it has a gray shade and the other one has a like a linen colored shade this color oh no i'm gonna have to tell somebody that black set that i just showed y'all was so cute but one thing and it's a trend right now because i or it's a trend i'm noticing because i keep on seeing it is that they have cute sets but they be so uncomfortable like they need to be comfortable it needs to do more than look cute like if i'm gonna be sitting outside for hours at a time it needs to it needs to function well as a seating a seating like it needs to it needs to be comfortable to sit in for long periods and that is just like the cushions be so thin and by the time you try to first of all it's eight hundred dollars for that four piece set the two chairs the couch and the table and by the time you try and find cushions that fit that you're gonna spend another one two three hundred dollars trying to find that so um me i would just buy something that's comfortable from the beginning Cute is all good, but comfort matters too, especially for like outdoor furniture, indoor furniture. <laughs> comfort matters. Not me running over the curb, girl. Lord. All right, let's go in Costco. Let's get these lobster rolls. 
and let's go home because we got to take the kids to swim. Yeah, these candles smell really good. This one, I think this is my favorite one, but I don't like this one. But these are so, smell good. Yeah, that smells really good. Yep, that smells good. This is the only one that I don't like. They are $20 for all four. They're giving out samples of these breakfast sandwiches, y'all. This one right here. And when I tell you, it's so good. Like, look at all the bacon. And it's so soft. I don't know how they cooked it, but it is good. Y'all, they're out of the lobster room kits. I'm gonna look one more time. Just to make sure I'm not overlooking it, but I think they're out. Yeah, I was reading the signs this time and I found it. They were hiding. <laughs> it's just this little bit left. Now I'm wondering if I should get two. Y'all, I'm just getting back to my neighborhood, but look, the pool is almost done. I'm so excited. I cannot wait until the pool is fully done so the kids can have some way to swim outside every day. Y'all, once that pool is open, one, they'll have an opportunity to meet a lot more kids in the neighborhood, and two, it's gonna be something for them to do every day because I guarantee you that they'll be trying to ride their bikes up here and come swimming, especially the older kids. They'll really be able to enjoy it even without me. So that would be like so much fun. I'm I'm probably gonna see very little of them once they open that pool up. Corey, I'll have to take her, but uh, Cody and Kane can ride their bikes up here and go to the pool on their own. So, and there is gonna be a lifeguard um, stationed at the pool. So that should be so much fun. I'm so excited about that. It's a lot of stuff happening, y'all. A lot of good stuff. So let me go in the house and get um, the kids ready for a swim, and I'll see y'all in a little while. Girl, they already got their bathing suits on. They're ready to go. <laughs> Costco haul. Y'all, these are the sandwiches they were giving. Oh, I showed y'all. I, I had to get them because they were so good. And then this, I think I showed y'all this last time I bought it. This is so good. If you haven't tried this yet, it is really good. You cannot tell the difference between this and normal pizza. And then I just got a bottle of the sangria. I get that a lot. Bonnie loves that. And then two boxes of the lobster rolls which I'm gonna leave out so that when it's time to cook dinner they'll be mostly thawed hopefully why would you throw her ear but her headphones and then when you break them I didn't throw her headphones I threw her bubble I put this in couch they could have just the lake could have what they look like air fryer microwave anyway oh my gosh it's still frozen solid let me throw this into some water but we have the seasoning packet we have the lobster meat and then we have the butter and the rolls. So I should have I should have took it out the box sooner because I think this is keeping it from thawing completely. Full crate. Full crate.